Stephanie and today I will be doing a demonstration on simple circuits. So before we get started we need to make sure we have all the materials out and ready. So you'll need a 9 volt battery, a battery snap uh, connector, sorry a battery snap connector, um, wire nut covers, a red blinking light emitting diode, and then two probes, a black and a red one. And then we also have special wire cutters. So once you have your probes you may need to cut the wire down to the appropriate size so you can use the back of the wire cutters and actually use them as a scissor to cut the wire down shorter and then you can see there's small holes um, in the wire cutter to strip the wire from the, the insulator from the wire so you just select the appropriate hole and place it over the wire and kind of wiggle to remove the insulator all right so now we have to build our um, circuit so first we have our LED and you need to identify the longer wire. So once you find the longer side, you can then take your battery snap connector and twist it around the longer portion. So you want to make a good connection. We're going to be making three easy connections here. So once you get the connection made, you can place the wire knot over top of it. And then you want to take the other side of the LED and twist the red probe around it. And then again, place the wire knot over top of it just to make sure the connection's good. If I can get it over. Okay, I think I have it. And then twist the two black wires together. So you're going to have the red on one side of the circuit and the black wires on another. Once you have those twisted, place the last wire nut protector over top. So, we have our, oh, it doesn't want to stay. It's being stubborn. So then we can attach the battery. All right, so we have made our circuit. Once we've completed the circuit, we can then test different solutions um, and see if there are any electrolytes present. So first we have distilled water, and there shouldn't be any ions in solution. So as you can see, um, the light bulb, the LED is not lighting up. So there's no electricity being conducted. Then we can test a salt solution. Place both of our probes in there and our LED blinks. So you can see there's ions present in the solution that are conducting electricity and completing our circuit. So another thing you can do with your um, circuit, your simple circuit, is place it in a pillbox, or in a, any container actually. We place it in a pillbox and this makes it child proof. So the battery and the snap connector are actually inside the pillbox and this is a lot safer for um, kids to use. 